Japan's Ministry of Defense mod latest white paper has revealed a new image of the Aegis system equipped vessel ASEV. Appearing similar to the Japan Maritime Self Defense Forces JMSDF existing Aegis equipped destroyers, the ship's development is in line with the security vision Japan shares with the United States, US, and their highly integrated military technology alliance. According to a report in Naval News, the ship is primarily a ballistic missile defense BMD vessel, an alternative to Japan's now cancelled land-based Aegis ashore BMD system. This is meant to counter the persistent missile threat from North Korea and China. Pyongyang's relations with Tokyo and Washington have been downhill in response to a US-Japan-South Korea axis. Beijing's ties with Tokyo and Washington have also been worsening over its territorially assertive behavior over the last few years. Far East Asia is now the biggest tinderbox in the world, with three flashpoints alone, the Korean Peninsula, the South China Sea, and the Taiwan Straits. The boats would have 128 vertical launch system VLS cells, more than its existing Maya Class 96 VLS cells, and the 112 VLS cells on China's Type 055 destroyer, the world's most heavily armed and advanced. The Maya is also the largest Aegis destroyer in the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force JMSDF. Japanese Navy Packs A Punch on July 4, it was reported that Japan's Ministry of Defense signed a contract with Mitsubishi Heavy Industries MHI, for the detailed design of the first ASEV and Japan Marine United JMU, for the same of the second ASEV. In 2023 Japanese Ministry of Defense allocated $1.58 billion to procure two additional ASEVs with SM-3 Block IIA and SM-6 missiles. The first ASEV is expected to be commissioned by the end of March 2028, with the second vessel to be inducted by March 2029. Japan has eight Aegis destroyers equipped for air and missile defense. But the country decided to build two more dedicated missile defense ships centered around the Lockheed Martin Spy 7V-1 radar that was originally meant for the two land-based Aegis ashore missile defense facilities. The report in Naval News added that the ASEV's 128 VLS cells would provide the ASEV with improved interception capabilities against conventional ballistic missile warheads and hypersonic glide vehicles HGVs. The Ministry of Defense explained in its budget request for fiscal year 2023 that the new ships will be 210 meters or less long, 40 meters or less wide, and have a standard displacement of 20,000 tons. In comparison, the two Azumo-class helicopter carriers, currently the biggest ships in the JMSDF, are 248 meters long, 38 meters wide, and have a standard displacement of 19,500 tons. However, following criticism over their size, lack of maneuverability, and cost, the Japanese Ministry of Defense revised its construction plans to make it smaller. The Asahi Shimbun reported on November 2022 that the ASEV is expected to be still larger than the Maya class, the largest Aegis destroyer of the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force standard displacement of 8,200 tons, length of 170 meters, width of 21 meters. The ships will each have a crew complement of 110 and carry standard missile 6 SM-6 for air defense and the indigenous Type 12 anti-ship missiles. North Korean missiles a threat. On July 24, North Korea fired two ballistic missiles into the sea off its east coast, South Korea's military said, hours after a U.S. nuclear-powered submarine arrived at a naval base in the south. Japanese Ministry of Defense also said the launch of what it said were two ballistic missiles by North Korea, both of which fell outside its exclusive economic zone EEZ. Following the July 21st launch, Pyongyang also warned that deployment of U.S. aircraft carriers, bombers, or missile submarines in South Korea could meet the criteria for its use of nuclear weapons. A week before that saw North Korea testing the Wasong-18 Intercontinental Ballistic Missile ICBM, which Pyongyang said was a warning to the United States and other adversaries. This is not to mention heightened Chinese and Chinese-Russian naval activity around Japanese waters. People's Liberation Army Navy planned warships regularly keep transiting the Miyako Strait, while the Japanese routinely intercept Chinese drones or watch Russian and Chinese 295 and H-6K bombers undertake strategic coordination patrols. 
The two countries recently concluded their Interaction 2023 series of naval maneuvers, including rare live missile firings and interceptions. The visit by Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shigu to North Korea, where he met President Kim Jong-un and attended an arms exhibition, clearly indicated that Russia and China are coordinating their actions. Defense White Paper Japan's latest defense white paper thus called the North Korean security threat bigger than ever before in a new era of crisis. North Korea's military activities pose an even more grave and imminent threat to Japan's national security than ever. It is believed that North Korea can attack Japan with nuclear weapons fitted to ballistic missiles. It also said China's military activities posed an unprecedented and the greatest strategic challenge to Japan, pointing to its military drills with Russia. Japan, the US, and South Korea have also undertaken BMD drills before the North Korean threat, with the last such maneuver in mid-July. This was following Pyongyang's firing of its Wasong-18 ICBM, 